Hi, so today in this video we are gonna make an endless star field using Adobe After Effects. Let's create a new composition and start with creating a new solid. Let's rename it to stars. And then we'll go to effects and look for CC Particle World. Drag it onto your solid and drag this line a little bit to the left. Now adjust longevity to about let's say 20 and before rate to about 15. Now go to the producer and make it to 1 in radius x, y and z. Now go to physics, make it to directional axis in animation, make velocity around 0.4, then make everything to 0 except extra angle, make it to 90 degrees. Also I want to mention that by changing an extra angle it changes the direction of uh, your star field flying so it really depends on what project you are making so try to improvise with it. Now go to particle, make it to faded sphere, as you can see there's something similar to stars. Adjust birth size to about 0.05, depth size to, size variation to 100 and max opacity to 100. Change the color to white and as you can see we have something similar to a star field. Now as you can see it moves but it doesn't look very realistic. Well I would say make it birth and depth size to 0.02. Also make this layer to a 3D layer and turn on a motion blur. And as you can see, it gives uh, such a motion blur to your star field. If you want to make it a little bit brighter, add the glow effect, make a threshold to about 10%, crank the glow radius and glow intensity. As you can see, it glows. That would be all in this video, so thank you so much for watching, and as always, see you in the next one. Bye!